everybody, it's the Musical Gamer again, and welcome back to Let's Play Artanelico, the melody of Alamia. Last time, we finally made it to the Floating Wharf, where apparently the church officials have just docked in their airship, being chased by the Tower Guardians. Radolf has enlisted our help to help fight it back, so let's do it. Let's go! It's boss time, everybody! No, oh wow, this is a big one. And that's what she said. Fortress class guardians. Oh, they'll call for help, won't they? No, oh, that's not good. All right, we need to beat this guy, well, relatively quickly. So, Misha, start charging up your energy ball. And... Oh, God. Oh, that's not good. That's actually really bad. Uh... <laughs> <laughs> oh dear. Um, impulse it. Oh god, this is actually very bad. Uh, Radolf, I'm going to actually have you use a replica horn on Crochet. Time for revenge. There you go. Uh, Crochet. Use. Oh god, uh, use a Dokoi set. Here you, go. you need, yeah, you need to heal at least a little bit. Let's continue. Ah, and there we go. Now you have your Cure Tablet. So, Chain Smash. All we can really do there. And Radoff now has access to, well, one of his two abilities. He can use Eternal Rain uh, at level 2 harmonics. Master Spear Skill of the Knights. Large physical damage applied by a quick strike. Uh, consumed HP 20% and he can now use the spear of end at level 1 medium physical damage and a potential a potentiality excuse me to paralyze that's what I'm hoping for so spear of end go damn it we didn't paralyze it and we really didn't do any damage uh crap okay impulse go don't attack crochet okay that's fine that is totally fine. We can deal with that. Uh, Cruce, use your Cure Tablet on Radolf. Cruce is pretty much going to be my healer while Misha's busy charging up an attack. Uh, use your regular attack. And same with you, Liner. Alert. Oh, crap. Here it comes. Oh, thank God it missed. Ha <laughs> ha. Oh, that was awesome. That would have called for support, uh, which we really don't want to have to deal with. Okay, Misha. Unleash your energy ball so we can start building up better harmonics. And that did decent damage. And we're on Harmo 2. Uh, okay. Chain tackle. Our attacks have now finally changed. Um, right. Well, let me should charge up a little more MP before then. Use. Oh, do I dare? Yeah, use Eternal Rain. I'll have to have Misha start healing. Oh god, Crochet's gone. Miscalculated. That's bad. Um, right. Oh, Misha's almost at full MP though. That's good. Uh, attack. Misha can actually revive people with Cinna, so I don't need to use replica horns all the time. That's it. Oh, wait, it doesn't? I thought it did. Oh, maybe I'm thinking of a later ability. Crap, that's what I'm doing. I'm thinking of a later ability. Never mind, don't mind me and my craziness. I'm gonna have to use a replica horn either way. Um, yeah. Just do it. Time for revenge. There you go, Crochet. Now use a cure tablet on yourself. And Radolf. I want you to use Spear of N. Maybe we can paralyze it. Paralyzing what it does is it gives you a chance of damn it. It gives you a chance of the enemy not being able to take a turn on its next turn, fa turn phase. Very convenient, especially on boss fights like this. Ow. Why? Hello. Tired. Um, Misha's not doing so hot. Uh, how are we doing on HP? We could we could use a little more. Uh, liner. Full stop. Okay, I'm gonna have to I'm gonna have to stop the song. Thank you, Misha, for all you've done. Uh, right. Chain Tackle, go! We can do this! 
We can do this! Do I have any more tranquility? Yes, I do. Speed up this process. Go, Misha, get some MP. Oh, perfect. Energy ball, go. Uh-oh. Crap! It got a Balthazar. Oh, that's an annoying ability of Balthazars, I just realized. They have self-recovery. That is actually quite annoying. Uh, level one, level two. Level one, and we should be able to take out that Balthazar with this one hit. So that really didn't do much against us, thank God. Otherwise, that would have been horribly annoying. Uh, oh, good, it is dead. And we almost got the other one. Call lightning. Ah, ow, 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 ow. You douche. It's terrible. Eternal rain, go. Oh, that didn't finish it off. Uh, but this should, Liner, finish it off with Impulse. Haha! -ha! You stood no chance against my mighty mightiness. And we get some nice experience. Everybody levels up, probably like two levels, because that's quite a lot of experience for this point. And Crochet learned the skill Overcooked Burner because she finally hit level 20. Uh, and, oh wow, here we go. Grade 4 items. Quick move. Magical. Copy X1, black stones, two recipe cards. Oh, Sword 1, yes, that's the one I really wanted. The Sword 1 recipe card is a new weapon for Liner, uh, should we be able to Grath Meld it. It's... The best weapons you're going to be able to get in the game are from Grath Melding. Just, just saying that right now. What am I doing here? Well, it's a long story. But you managed to tell in a total of two seconds. Well, it's awesome. Yeah. Uh, oh, you're gonna give us a ride. Well, that sounds like a sounds like a good plan. Sweet. All right. Awesome. Ah, eh. oh, Crochet's gotta go. Yeah, that's right. This was her destination. Our destination's Nemo. Oh, you have your own airship? Why didn't you tell us this before? And she's finished three airships. Oh my God. Oh yeah, that's it! She can fix our airship! Good thinking, Liner. I actually probably wouldn't have thought of that. Hmm, yeah, but she does have to appraise the damage, I guess. Alright, well, I- oh, she'll meet us in Nemo. Perfect, alright, well, she'll meet us in Nemo, and then once we're all, you know, safe in Nemo, we'll take her over to Viola Forest. Alright, and we can leave whenever we're ready, so let's heal up. Talk to Misha, of course, of course. Come in, Misha. Oh, she's really happy. Oh, she's thanking us for the tranquility. Awesome. And that is that. Uh, now, this is also a shop here. They don't really have much I want, but um, you guys can take a look if you are playing along with me. All right, we are ready. Let's go. Finally, we'll be back in civilization after so long. So like flying. It's a real lifesaver. By the way, what were you doing at the floating wharf? Oh yeah, they never really explained this. As I mentioned before, we were on a mission. Yeah. I'm not supposed to tell this to outsiders, but I can trust you. We're searching for the Him Crystal. Uh, wait, wait, the Him Crystal? The Him Crystal? Oh, are you interested in it as well? Absolutely. Can you tell me anything about it? Actually, I don't know much about it myself. What a coincidence is this? They're he looking for it too. The real expert. He should be able to answer your questions. Oh, okay. For now, you should just enjoy the ride. Well, we'll do that. Thanks, Radoff. You're a good guy. Bishop Falls. Hmm. Liner. Uh, oh, hey, Misha. Misha, what is it? I want to feel the wind. <laughs> I thought you were afraid of heights. Uh, oh, yeah. Yep, there it is. What are you doing? <laughs> Liner, <laughs> come closer. Huh? Oh, yeah, I forgot. You're afraid of heights. Oh, Liner. How could you forget? If it's getting too much for you, we could go inside. No, I like it here. 
Well, for someone who's afraid of heights. Liner, has your memory improved yet? Do you remember me? <laughs> about that. No, I don't. I'm sorry. Yeah. That's okay. Didn't think you would. It's been a long time. I used to live in Platina. I moved away when you were only this big. Really? People don't usually move away from Platina. That's a good point. I know. I guess that makes me special. But not in a good way. I was born to fulfill a mission. That's why I had to leave Platina. A mission? From the gods? Liner, I... Uh-oh. Uh Haha. <laughs> hey, 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 Orica! Uh... You... What? Do you know her? What's that? Uh-oh. Uh -oh. What the hell? Oh, God. It, oh, God. It, what the hell? The ships look exactly the same except for the color. I never really understood that. Ah, oh, great. It's Tenba. Hey, kid. Did you really think you could get away? Um, would it be stupid if I said yes? I look at you with your happy Ravatil. And it's like you're slapping me in the face. Oh, good. Yeah. Well, I've taken Misha back. The rest of you can go straight to hell. Well, you could go straight to hell, buddy. Not on my watch. Exactly. Ha ha. Say goodbye. Uh, oh crap. Orca. That's bad. If you don't stand still, I'll drop this girl. You wouldn't dare. Why must you be such a pain? Come on over, Misha. Or do you want me to drop this girl? You coward! Oh, God. Are you gonna come peacefully? I'll never take orders from you! Yeah, you tell that asshole. Then you just killed this girl. Wait, no. Don't tell that asshole. Don't tell that asshole! No. Orca! What's going on? Boy! Yeah, we have a little bit of a problem here, Radolf. No, hello, Radolf. My fight's not with you today. I've got some business with a kid to deal with, so I thought I'd stop by. But you're threatening a rave tale of the church. So, this matter is no longer just between you and Lina. What? She's a rave tale? <laughs> I got a great idea. Oh, crap. Why did you have to open your mouth, Radolf? Whoa! Hey, kid, bring Misha over. I wish I could jump that high. That was awesome. I mean, wait, no. Board evil. Bad board. Misha, stay here. I'm going by myself. Liner, I'm coming with you. That's not a good idea, no, Misha. You're afraid of heights. You'll never make it. Well, that and the fact that he's trying to capture you. Well, we'll leave that card to the church officials, and Liner will take care of board himself. Awesome. The showdown is happening. Where's Misha? Stupid, or don't you understand your predicament? Hurry up and bring me Misha. Otherwise, I'll drop this one right now. Wait! Uh, what the? Misha! What, Misha, what are you doing here? What's wrong? Afraid of heights or something? Shut up! I'm coming, so just let her go. Excellent. But you have to walk up to me alone. Oh, you sadistic bastard! No, Misha, don't do it! Liner, I'm sorry. I have to go. No! No, you don't, Misha! Misha, you don't have to do this. Don't worry. I'll be okay. I'm not that scared of heights. Oh, I'll don't lie. I'll be back. Wait for me. Famous last words, everybody. <laughs> no, I'm just kidding. I'm just kidding. No, Misha! No! Don't go! No, you're one of my favorite Raven Tales. Don't go. Good girl. That's exactly how all Raven Tales should act. I don't need this one anymore. Uh, wait, what? Orca! No! Oh God. Good save, Liner. I'm gonna. Go. I have to give you props right there. Why are you 
risking your life to save me. Because it's in my blood, I, I guess. Reflexes, I, guess. <laughs> I don't know. Reflexes. What? What kind of excuse is that? Uh, I can't hold on much longer. Uh, that's not good. Then don't. You've already done enough. <sighs> I'm almost spent. I'm sorry. Save yourself. Let go of my hand. I will never do that. Don't say that. No matter what, I won't give up on you. It, no! no! Ow! It, what the? We, we were saved? What kind of, what, whose airship is this? Looks like it. That was close. It, wait a minute, that voice. You can pay me back with a month's supply of Dokoi sets. Oh god, that, requ that, oh, that requirement. Crochet! It is Crochet! Hey, long time no see. I knew something bad was gonna happen when I saw Tenba arguing with the church, so I followed you. <laughs> but I didn't expect to have to perform a miracle. Well, I'm glad you did save my life. Thanks. I gotta admit, I thought we were gonna die. Well, there is a slight problem. Uh, what? what is it? I can't control a ship. Wait, say that again! What? We might get to go to heaven after all. What? Are you serious? Oh crap. Oh god. I regret nothing. Well, looks like we lived. But I'm pretty sorry for your airship, Crochet. That's that kinda sucks. Well, it looks like we're all okay, and now Orica's with us. Uh, oh, that's... Wow. Great thing to say, Crochet. <laughs> wow, you're mean. <laughs> Blame it on my dark sense of humor. Oh, God. Uh, okay, that's a little too much information, Crochet. But shame on me. First of all, ew. Second, it's not like that at all. Yeah, really, it really isn't like that. Okay, so we're on the Falcon's Claw right now. It's a floating dragon's nest that's isolated from the Wings of Horus. Awesome! We're in a land inhabited by bloodthirsty carnivorous dragons. Yay! Alright, well, we'll explore the Falcon's Claw next time on Let's Play Artanelico. I'm the Musical Gamer, signing off. See you guys next video!